How to subtract text from a shape in Affinity Photo. Go to the Tools panel and select the Frame Text tool. You could also use the Artistic as well. Drag out and then go up here, Text and Insert Fill the Text and just add some random text. You need to convert it, you need to convert it to curves. Go to Layer and Convert to Curves. Now you can resize it, you can modify the nodes. And also you can see over here, you've got in the layers panel, a group. And you've got lots and lots of curves, they're all individual curves. So select that curve, all the way down to the bottom curve. Go to the layer menu and down to geometry and merge curves. All becomes one curve. Now go to the curves here. Select that and drag it outside of the group. And you can delete the group. Go to the tools panel and select the rectangle tool or any of the other shapes. Rectangle and just drag out there. Want it to be below the curve, so just drag it down. Select it and drag down. Select both of the shapes, both the curves there, curves and rectangle. Go to layer and down to geometry and subtract. So subtract, and there it is. You've subtracted your text from that shape. Go to the tools panel and select a different tool. I'm gonna to go with the ellipse tool. Hold down shift, create a circle. And this time, the ellipse is gonna be above the text. Select both the shapes. So we've both selected. Go to layer and down to geometry and subtract. And this time, the circle is cut away from the text. Go to the Artistic Text tool and create some text. Subtract. What you need to do then, again, go to Layer and down to Convert to Curves. It's been converted. Go here, Group, select all of the curves. All of them are selected. Go to Layer and Geometry and Merge Curves all merged into a single curve. Then select that and drag above the group and remove the group, just delete it. Go to the tools panel again and select the diamond tool this time. Create it and then you can see diamond and curves. I'm just gonna move the diamond below the curves. So just below there and you've got the word SU. I can select both of them. So we've both selected go to layer and geometry and subtract. And you can see it's just cut away, all that text is gone, and you've got the SU there left over with the diamond. Go to the tools panel and select another shape. This time I'm gonna go with the star tool. Create a star, drag that out there, and this time I'm gonna keep the star or the shape, it could be anything, above the curves. Select both. So both are selected, go to layer and geometry and subtract. And this time you can see the star has been cut away from the text. The text has been converted to curves. You can't edit it anymore, but you can duplicate it. Hold down the alter option key and drag. And you've got two curves, subtract and subtract. You can select both, go to layer and down to Geometry and Subtract. And the Subtract will be cut away from the Subtract. The curves can be duplicated multiple times. Hold down the Alter Option key and duplicate it. And you can repeat it three, 10, 15 times. You can also resize the curves. You can also rotate it and repeat again. Hold down the Alter Option key and duplicate it again by dragging. Select all of the curves, go to Layer and Geometry and Subtract. And then you've got probably even more unusual text from that. Hope you found this tutorial of interest. Any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Always great to hear from you. Thank you much.